She's been there the longest. But she didn't get a lot of time because she was playing behind Monica Sinano. Three balls, good. Amor, good if it goes. Got it! Oh. 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 tonight. Something going on tonight in the Queen City. Amor, half court. Message delivered. Game on. 14-2. Hokey run. Got beat in the tournament champ in the tournament and uh, ended up playing the WNIT. Uh, first time they've ever made the postseason. Georgia Amor with a bit of a shrug there. Such is the life of a mid major. Wow. Georgia Follow through was perfect for Georgia Amor. Now she's in double figures. There's a double double for her. One arm pass to the freshman. Kalfani running the point, bounces it in. Nice as Grady. Telegraph by Amor. Outnumbered. What a step in the finish. Quickly stolen by Amor. One on one, hard bounce. Heck to the glass. Nice job running the floor. Claire Strack, who kept that ball alive on the glass. This is an interesting lineup, a big lineup. Georgia Amor sells the pump fake and knocks down the triple. Highlanders have not sunk a field goal so far in the second half. Here's Strack with the mid range. Young's a tough matchup for Kitley, but so far hasn't had much production. There's Georgia Amor just chucked that thing up against the glass. Three on the way. Georgia Amor able to sink her first of the afternoon. And she's wearing something to protect it to an extent. The black sleeve. There's a steal from Amor. It's a three on two for Tech. Amor, King, Eck. Baseline drive and one. And he's going to try to do the same with Pittsburgh here this year. And in the coming years, I should say. Amor, open lane and one. Coming up. There it is. Biscuits for all. And, and animated cheers at that. And what a way to do it, Georgia Amor. And you see them every now and then. They're a good team. They've got a lot of weapons. So if you want to stop Kidley, okay. But you got to find a way to stop this. Amor sets up Eck, burying the three. Timeout, Demon Deacons. A couple assists for catch and shoot. On the transition, push it down the floor. You've got to get back to defense. And she can go by you, but she won't. Ty Harrison takes it. Good hit. Again, side was clear for Harrison that time to go to the right. She's got to knock that shot in. Another friendly rim. They're going to try to use Collins' quickness. And that time, Collins settled for threes. Good quick turnaround. That is money in the bank. Virginia Tech loves the back screen. Pokies. Trailing the third rank wolf pack. Amor, can she get one to fall? You betcha. You know who's going to keep shooting? Georgia Amor. Amor. Three defenders around her. Draws the foul. Will shoot the free throw. A little bit of a hard time in shoot around today <laughs> because I saw her shooting threes and she was making all of them. So I told her shoot one in the game and she said she might. Well, she did, Jen, and she knocked it down. Eck. Well, both of these teams want to play in transition, so pace is not going to be an issue, but you got to get up on Georgia Amor. Kitley right back to Georgia. And then a wide open look for Eck in the corner for her first points of the day. Everything kind of opens up. It loosens the defense a little bit. And so that's what you're going to be looking here for this Duke squad. You just saw Carol Lawson triple by Amor. Yeah, you just can't, you can't fall asleep right there. I mean, she's quick. She's active. Averaging 11 points. Three Blue Devils are averaging double figures this season are coming into this ball game as Georgia Amor left alone, and that's a bad idea. Nice alert play after Amor missed the layup. She's at the basket, so she's not back on defense. But you know where she is? 
She's back on offense. Yes, she is. There's a three ball. Amor pushes it. Didn't have any help. Somehow weaves through traffic. Still finds a window in which to shoot. And it rattles home. Eye on it. It's worth another glance at what Amor did just to get open, much less finishing with the score. I want you to do Back trying to find an outlet and ends up in the hands of Amor. Defensive transition is so important for Syracuse. And that's the one thing that they don't want is to allow a three. They're going to come down, and if you don't get in front of their face in defensive transition, you see here, hands down. She's so You see Virginia Tech, they play really good team defense. They're in this zone. They try to keep some penetration in the middle. Shot clock down to five and take it away. Georgia Amor picks the pocket. And Amor lays it up and in. Transition and then just doing it on both ends of the floor. She can play defense as well. Gets the layup here for more. She doesn't care what people have to say. That she's undersized like me. Got excited when she followed her after the final <laughs> four. And then you know what's next. <laughs> Top dog in the class. <laughs> Amor. Gets through everybody. Give her another yeah. assist. Two more points for Kelly, who now has 33. This pass, no look, Ooh. shovel pass to whom else? Kitley for the finish. <laughs> <laughs> Leaving them guessing. And Usby again brings the double. Amor left open momentarily, big, huge three. The hustle, the extra play, an extra pass. Amor. Okay. Amor, good look at the three. Look at the zip on that pass. Late to recover. Amor around the Kitley screen. Now, she somehow slithered by everybody. Two guards we talked about. Georgia Amor getting to the rim. Just a little pass. Fan. And if you're picking your poise and you want a Zaya James shooting step back threes, but when she's hot, you got to find different ways to be disruptive in the two man. Amor, long three and the pose. Terrific space, and then Amor, the screen, and a little pop back. Running back the other direction, King. Georgia Amor chucks one. Two in a row for Virginia Tech. So the block from Kitley, Hokies in transition. Kitley's open down low, and that combination's got Amor fired up. She has their first eight points, wow. I did that within it. Before three minutes expired in that game, they're hosting Michigan. Amor, so tough, drew the foul. Get to her second foot, where generally you'd shoot it off your left foot. She shoots it off of her right. It too. Right it was where a good she pass wanted it. The rim. There you go, Georgia Amor. Her That's first three after she missed four. Mm. Louisville always draws well. Amor to Kitley, going to the basket. Into the corner, wide open. It's a miss. Sumiol tried to get it. Kayla King coming out with it. Amor for two at the elbow. Swish! A little grimy. It's been a little dirty, but it has worked. They've been terrific at making shots. Sumiol takes the charge. Obviously, a foul. And Georgia Amor, I think, revved up the engine while she was sitting on the bench. Quick points and then also distributing the rock. As that was a uh, hand in the cookie jar. Sneaky from Deja Kelly poking it away. But that's the result. Amor for three. Georgia Amor. One of the part of one of the best duos, if not the best duo. The West Bell missed the North Carolina loss with a concussion. That one was 61 to 57 and a lay in by Eck on the other end. So the Hokies with a lot of work to do as we get set for the fourth quarter. Amor straight on and makes it a little bit easier with a triple. And that's it at the horn as they creep to it in six. To get better for Virginia as a season has gone on. Goes against one of the top shot blockers in the ACC though. Kitley stuffing Johnson on that attempt. Amor on the other end for three. Seven on the shot clock. Amor, crossover, triple. 
Doncic, he has got that down to the men's game. But if you watch Luka Doncic, this is his move. Step back, going left, right in that same spot on the floor. Couple years at Duke, knocked away by King. Nice to keep it going, the knee shot to Georgia. There's your first bucket. They hit 16 all year. Here's Kayla King getting in the passing lanes, and I love this play from Misha. Really smart. Just get the ball. Guarded by Day Wilson. Strack with a nice oh, screen. That is a tough shot. We'll combine points so far in this third quarter. And look at that screen from Clara Strack. Good job of setting her NBA All Star. There's Misha. Up to Georgia, great catch. God, that was a terrific catch. Georgia, just three points, one of nine from the floor. It was a three she hit early on. Driving the baseline up, and in. I mean, so, change of pace. Virginia Tech has missed nine straight shots. That breaks it with Amor, who has a chance for a three-point play.